Hello fellow Sudokans, welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Monday the 9th of June 2025. I hope you are uh, keeping well, keeping safe, keeping healthy, all of those things as much as, as you possibly can. Uh, we have the English noun and adjective humanitarian. I don't believe there's an opposite word, but there ought to be. Maybe we, I, w I might suggest inhumanitarian. Uh, that might work. Um, and if there is one, it would definitely apply to a certain person, a certain person who's... Uh, <laughs> whose presence is usually orange in colour. Uh, just today uh, goes the ban from... Um, absolute ban on, on uh, um, citizens travelling to the US from particular countries. I'm going to read out those countries and uh, you might find a pattern uh, emerging. So I'm going to read out the list of countries that are now banned, but um, citizens of which are now banned from entering the US. Absolutely banned. Afghanistan, Myanmar, Chad, Republic of Congo, Equatorial Guinea, Eritrea, Haiti, Iran, Libya, Somalia, Sudan, and Yemen, absolute bans and severe restrictions on Burundi, Cuba, Laos, Sierra Leone, Togo, Turkmenistan and Venezuela. What's the pattern of, of, about most of those places? Not not all of them, but, but certainly a, a huge majority of those places. They are really difficult places to live because the politics of the in the country or the economic conditions in the country, often caused by the polit political problems, are dire and the people are desperate and they would really need to get away and get somewhere where they're given an opportunity of a better life and that opportunity will definitely be not coming from not forthcoming from trump who is an inhumanitarian uh, that's the nicest thing i could say about him i could say some really nasty expletive expletives which is how i really feel but anyway i'll give him the title of inhumanitarian because that's a, a word that doesn't exist, but um, I think I don't think it exists anyway. But um, it ought to, and it definitely applies to him. Let's get on with our game of Sudoku. What have I got for you? This is the uh, third in the regular games of uh, Daily Trio. Uh, this is the Los Angeles Times expert level puzzle. Today's New York Times was pretty tough. I thought this morning. And of course, the other game was the Guardian, which on a Monday is always a beginner's game. So that one doesn't really count. Three's blocking across here and across here like that. And there's a three. Hmm. Two and three across there, two and three down there. Look, we found ourselves a quick pair. Two and three in those squares. What does it mean? Uh, well, it certainly means that Two is in that square there, right? Two is going up there. Two is there in those squares blocking up. Two across there and across there. There's our two. And can we get the threes as well? Three up there. Three up there. Three across there. Yes. Oh, that's very nice, isn't it? And in fact, we're going to continue with the threes. Okay. Anything else on the twos? Uh, maybe not. But we've got six blocking this square, this square, and this square. So in this column, there's a six. Five and seven block up here. That puts five and seven into those squares. And guess what? We've got seven blocking there. So there's our seven and there's our five. Four blocks across here. That will give me a four in that square. The last number to place there is an eight. Four and eight block this square here. We're looking. For, that's going to put four and eight in those squares there, which means that that's going to be a five. Four across this way and this way. There's the four. <laughs> and, and four blocking that square there. In fact, there's the four. And that's the eight. I feel like I did something weird there. Like I did something wrong. But anyway, I, I don't know. 
Uh, two blocks this square here, so we need a two there for the row. I hope I have chosen the expert level game here. This is a bit of an easy start. Um, but perhaps I've done something wrong. Nine there. I get a little suspicious sometimes. It was, oh, maybe it's going to end up to be uh, end up being a really tough ending. It sometimes is if it starts quick like this, super quick. It sometimes ends up ends up being uh, very slow at the end. Uh, so we've got eight and nine over there, and these two squares are what five and two. All right. Uh, maybe we'll go through the digits now. See if we spot anything useful. We've got ones there, ones there. I already said this. Oh, I didn't really explore this two and three much, did I? Is there anything else that um, I should be looking at? We've got two and three. Um, maybe we'll have a look up this here. So we've got two and three. We're looking for one, um, four, six, eight, I think, in those squares. Hmm, that's not very t useful. Four, six, one, four, six down there, six. Hmm. I don't know. Let's uh. Okay, sevens on this side. So that's a pair of seven, nine up there, seven, nine across there. So we've got another pair of seven and nine in those squares there. So the 9 then blocking down here and 9 blocking down here, there's the 9. And we can get this, which is f uh, 6, I think. Now I had 2 and 3 in those squares there, so now when the 6 blocks down here, that gives me a 6 in that square there, doesn't it? So two, three there, so the missing digits up there are one, four, eight, I think. And on this side, they're going to be five, seven, nine, seven and nine in the same row there. That's a five. one blocking this square and this one blocking this square so there's one in that row
this was two and three wasn't it so we've got one and four blocking there that means that's one and four and the other number that goes there is eight nine blocking down nine across there there's a nine Six blocking here and there, there's a six. Eight across there, there's the eight, and this would be a five. Eight blocking this square in this row, there's our eight. The last number there's a four, I think. Uh, <coughs> what's left? Two, three across there, that's not going to be useful yet, is it? So we've got to look somewhere else um, across here maybe one oh no <laughs> not that this was two and three wasn't it um, and this is one and four Okay, so we've got five blocking this square, this square, five blocking this square. So in that column there, there's our five. Five across here, five up there, there's a five. The last number to place for this column, six. Six across there, six up there, there's a six. Four blocking up there, there's a four. This would be one across there, there's a one. The last number to get there is nine. Nine across to the end, and nine blocking up there, there's a nine. Uh, seven blocking up there, there's a seven. Seven across there, there's a seven. This would be eight across that way there's the eight last number to go there is four four blocking down here and down there and across there says you must be a four four across this way four down there there's a four and the last number in the column is one one across one down across there I should say actually and one there there's one and the last number there five Five up, five across there, there's a five. And the last number to get there is um, two. So down there, uh, no, not a six. Uh, is it eight? I think it is eight. Okay, we've also got eight blocking there. There's eight, and this will be nine. And down here, uh, three three across that way there's a three uh, this will be a two two blocking that way there's a two that will be a nine. Oh, that's it okay so uh, yeah not too bad there I think uh, that's our LA times expert level puzzle over and out for Monday take care bye bye